Say the meal with a different taste, bite after bite. Come on, tell us again. And don't skip a single bite. First bite. That's new Nacho's Bel Grande. Houston, I'm approaching the Alpha Quadrant. Looks like another splendid day in space. <laughs> Oh yes, now I can understand you much better. Okay. That is an incredible t piece of technology. Mind if I take a look at it? Human! Focus! Human! I demand you teach me how to make nachos! Nachos? Did you say nachos? Yes. Is that why you beat me here? Yes. This is a pretty important moment for my species. First contact. Wow. Human! Focus! Nachos! Human! Nachos! G is okay, okay, okay. Nachos. Sure, I can teach you how to make nachos, but keep in mind, you know, I am an astronaut, not a chef. All my food comes pre-made in little metallic pouches. That's okay. Well, okay then. Let's check out what ingredients you got. Asteroid fragments. Asteroid fragments? Okay, I suppose we can use those as some sort of spaceship. Molten lava. Hmm. Seems like that would give me some indigestion, but I guess we could mix it with some cheese if you think you can stomach it. I can. Okay, what else you got? Jalapenos. Jalapenos. You have jalapenos in space? Yes, jalapenos are everywhere. Weird. Okay, let's get started. Welcome back to another episode of Home Cooking, the cooking show where I, professional chef Mirabel Bonjour Sr., judge your homemade meals. Next up we have... Blorp. Am I, blorp. Am I saying that right? Well, this looks interesting. Some sort of gourmet nacho recipe. Let's have, let's try. <laughs> yeah, those jalapenos can be spicy. 